I'm not gonna lie, I have no clue what's going on in the plot of Misfit of Dingan King Academy. I mean, season one, I could keep up with recently in season two. I feel like if you don't have the context in the light novel, it's so hard to really understand what's going on as an anime only. That's why I really appreciate it whenever you guys let me know in the comments about what's actually going on. All I know is we killed that kid benevolently so that he could be resurrected in time. And now what are we doing? I don't really know. Let's begin today's reaction. He sounds like the heavenly God though. We're talking about Shin, but doesn't he sound like the Heavenly Father? I don't understand gods either, man. The Blaze Death King can simply assume... Th That's the thing about this show is everybody is like wearing masks and like they're, they're someone else entirely different. That's right. Child of God and Great Spirit. We're trying to get a spirit and God combined. Okay. So Nosgaria might be on our side because they're using him like that. Okay. Misha's got the plot. Canon, the hero canon is such a good character. Like, good as in he's so pure and kind. But it's for the sake of Anos, but I get what Shin's saying. Hmm. Oh! Kind of impressive he caught that. This is also true. Shin's not wrong. Yes! <laughs> we don't really need to help, to be honest. Anos will figure shit out. And then he comes back as Rei. And he assumed that fake position himself. Oh. See? That's why I thought that Rei might have been, you know, canon in season one. Dude, this loyalty and this friendship, this brotherhood, man, it's so good. Who did Shin turn into, though, re reincarnate? Because that's what we don't really know yet, right? And we thought that we were going to meet the Spirit King or whatever that could have been Shin, but it turned out to be Misa instead. And we still don't know who Shin is 2,000 years later, right? What, over losing his boyfriend? You know, when Anos had to die? Did Shin change? I can't tell. Oh, because he didn't completely slash him. He's... <laughs> wow, really? Maybe the love is paying off instead of just outright cutting his head off. Hmm. You are in love with them. Yeah, you are. Huh? Love. <laughs> you didn't know? Okay. I, I, okay, I, I guess she wasn't fully aware, but it's funny that she's like, Oh shit, I'm in love with you, by the way. Aww. But can Shin understand and reciprocate the feelings? Like, he looks so confused because he probably wants to be nice to her, but he doesn't understand love. <laughs> no! But... Mm. Oh, what a ladies man, Shin. Oh, damn. Scabber doesn't, he was able to sheath his sword and he doesn't have to live that life anymore. Oh? Huh? Because he's going to reincarnate. <laughs> Bros before hoes? <laughs> you really going to let her go, bro? I'm sorry, my allegiance is with my king and not you. <laughs> Yeah! Technically, you guys had a six-month hiatus of being together. Yo, this season fucking started in, like, January this year, bro. It's just been, like, eight months of you guys being together. Your seed. Hmm. Ah. A marriage? Oh, okay. This is super cute. Sure. I'm helping Shin. Shin's like, sure. All right. Shit on one knee, asking for what kind of marriage you'd like. That is, what a gentleman. Didn't expect someone like him to be able to show, I don't know, this kind of mannerism. Yes, wedding, wedding, wedding. I mean, he kind of is, but, you know. Exactly, exactly. I mean, come on, his face is exactly the same. Look at his eyes. And shoe, really? But, but with this marriage, now the kid is Misa, right? Because Misa's dad is some kind of like sword god. And it's pretty much official that Leno was the mom, right? Right? Am I forgetting something? It's kissy time, come on. Oh. Oh! Say it back. Say it back! Say it back! My allegiance of the Anos. I love Anos. <laughs> no! 
say it. But I deadass thought that he was gonna say I love Anos, bro. <laughs> oh, this is so nice. But where does the sad shit start happening? Chin is really slowly turning around. Allow me to dream like this. Like he's actually happy. And now I must leave for my lord. Yeah? What? You got, isn't there a honeymoon? Wedding night? You know, you, you, got, you, you gotta go on a little trip. Mm. Oh, what's gonna happen? Are we about to conceive Misa? Uh, yeah. What's up? Uh-huh. What are you saying? What are you trying to say here? Oh, oh yeah? You just want to sleep on a bed? Okay. They're not gonna fuck, right? They're not gonna fuck, right? Shin was a god sling sword that turned into Shin, right? So when did they actually meet? Huh? Oh, he already had a body? How did the body just form, though? Oh. Well, if you have nothing to lose, maybe you could fight better. But people argue that if you have something to protect, you could also fight better. Double-edged sword. If one day came across Anos. Finally, someone that can actually duel me. Interested. He fell in love, bro. <laughs> Shin fell in love right now. <laughs> no love. That's what makes me strong. Okay. Shin got bored. He realized this guy is super strong. All right, if I was with him, I'll have strong opponents. Evil god killing sword. But how did that happen? Like, how did you manifest into a human form, you know? You know, they say if you're with a girl, you shouldn't be talking about past love lives of like with different partners. But right now, it feels like on the night of the wedding, <laughs> Shin is pretty much talking about his past love with Anos and how he met him and he fell in love. <laughs> I wonder if she feels super jealous. Oh. It's our wedding night, by the way. Mm. Oh, what are you trying to do? What do, you, what do you want? Huh? What are you trying to do? Oh, you're bad boy. I'm not hurt like that. <laughs> Yo, is he packing? I want some kind of implied... I, I, some kind of scene that implies, you know, they did the deed. You're what? <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> there is the. It's not implied anymore. It's pretty much just like, you know, wedding night. Gee, I wonder what happened. It's your child with the spirit king. Is this important? Spirits can have child childs with demons, but somehow they did. Is this an exception or did something special happen? Or? Oh, child may expire? That's fucked up, but we've seen how other spirits kind of just like disappear and shit like that in season one, right? She's a mom now. Shin, be happy. You're a dad. Yep. I just can't even imagine Shin having sex. Like, I don't know. I just can't imagine like him even knowing like the concept of it. Misa. Gord? But Gord. What? I, I know we have Misa, but like, could you imagine if Gord actually exists or some shit? All right, Misa, I knocked you up. I gotta leave now. Bye. Are you gonna leave your pregnant wife? Abandoning your pregnant wife to be with the bros. <laughs> I know it's more than that, but if you really think about it, that's exactly what he's doing. You should be more upset. I know, but still at the end of the day, he fucking just left his pregnant wife. Now it's a mother to spirits and demons. Oh! Oh. Contradict the lore. Then you just die. And that's what she decided to side with her baby. Yeah, makes sense. <laughs> I wonder if Shin is capable of crying. Maybe that is foreshadowing. In the future, when Shin does cry, that is proof that he knows love. That's kind of crazy that you have to fucking... You have to just use your own life to make him care about you, but alright. Oh. Heavenly God. Heavenly God. No, Skarya. Shin, no! You gotta go back! Is, is it too late? No, 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 no! This fucking menace, dude. Oh, it's just the head? <laughs> He's just the head right now? 
Are you telling me? Wait, it wasn't Shin that knocked her up? Wait, what are, you, what are you trying to say right now? The miraculous seed. Whose seed is it? Heavenly Godfather, what did you do? Wait, what? So you like possessed Shin and gave your godly seed to her? I don't know, I don't know. Therefore, it is proof that the God's words were absolute. Therefore, his version of the kid, that kid in there, it was heavenly gods, kind of. I don't know. Oh, are we getting a birth scene right now? Oh, oh what the fuck? I, I don't know. And then where does Lena come into this, you know? The spirit who can save this child. Is this Lena? Or I... I Cause like this Leno's disappearing, right? Oh, this is just sad, bro. She, she dead ass couldn't even hold the baby. It's my child. It's still the baby you gave birth to! Shin! Enough talking, bro. It really is pointless. It's already too late. The Heavenly Father is just too OP. The gods can just like literally just say something and it becomes reality. It's beyond busted. Huh? No, it was love. It was... Oh, I, you don't know that, right? I don't know. No, the Heavenly God cheated. This is fucked up. Okay, that makes a lot more sense as to why Misha is not like really old because like sent her into the future. A child rumors are lord. It's Avos's. But don't worry, Anos figures it out. He always does. Even if she betrays. And she has. And she did. He will spread that fictional lord. I thought he cut up the baby for a second, bro. Because <laughs> you know, sometimes he goes like this and everything just disappears. Oh. But we still have Lena in the future, right? <gasps> She died smiling, bro. Shin actually looks sad too. Maybe he'll cry here. Three day marriage. Wait, how did the baby get formed within the span of three days? Don't worry about it. Wow. That was some ZOM 100 shit. Wide screen to full screen color, everything. That was beautiful. Will he cry? Oh, the burial. That's where he planted the sword. And the flower that Lena picks up, it's that one! That's a 2,000 year old flower! This is actually so sad. Yo, fuck these gods, man. And now we're back. Present day. What a long flashback, but that shit was... I guess I'm a monster for not crying. Let's go! Next episode, it's gonna be real! I'm still a bit confused, but I'm still kind of there, you know? I thought that Shin and, you know, Leno had the baby. And that's Misa. But it's actually impossible, you know? The, the, it's, it's said that a demon and a spirit cannot have a baby together. But if it's a god saying his words as an absolute truth, now the baby is technically a god and a spirit, and therefore Misa was born. So Lena saying, you know, it was love, it was a miracle, that was a lie. I hope it's not a lie. I don't know how this is going to work. And at the very end, I think Shin said, even if the baby like is to betray Anos, like he'll figure something out, right? So Misa betraying Anos like this right now isn't too big of a deal because I'm sure we'll somehow figure shit out. Maybe she's being brain controlled. You know, the classic of, oh, the person we thought we was on our team was actually being mind controlled and was actually not them properly. We've had a ton of that in season one. So I have no doubt Misa will come back. Somehow Misa and Rei, you know, their love and their fucking necklace shit. That'll I'm sure to come to play, but it's going to be good next episode. Oh, it's going to be pop off episode. But hey, if you're still here, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.